it's ajar. His shaving kit on the outside window. Still, he goes back in, locks the door, and calls the front desk. He tells the worker about what happened. And then she says there wasn't any break-ins, and they never called him. His body was found the next day in one of the motel brooms closet. Jeez. Was he murdered by a ghost or something? Oh shit. But it Man, it's actually kind of cool to see Goombas again. You know, like we only saw them at like the beginning of the game. But it's kind of it kind of brings back that nostalgia from the beginning of the game. Yeah. Just gonna do that situation. There we go. Uh, what's this shit? The fuck's this shit? Uh, my turn? Okay, there we go. Uh, I don't really know that many stories. Uh, I could tell you an urban legend that's in my neighborhood. Uh, this is a puzzle probably, right? Wait a minute. Oh, do you have to, like, hit it a certain amount of times? There we go. Alright. So, there's this urban legend in, 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 in my town that I currently live in. And that I grew up in. Um, there's this thing called the Charman. I don't know if you guys have heard of that. Uh, basically, the Charman is a guy... It's kind of like a uh, Jason Voorhees situation. Like, he kind of, like... Got made fun of a lot as a kid, and and he's at and he and this guy kind of like the 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 urban legend is at this camp that I used to go to as a kid. Um. Oh shit. Oh, the super boots. Super. Bo oh, ultra boots. Fuck yeah. Uh. Anyway, with Charman, uh, it's kind of like the typical like. Like, you know, like, he, like, kidnaps kids, and he, like, takes them to, like, this cave that's, like, right, that's really close by to the, the camp or whatever. And the only thing that, you know, keeps him from kidnapping and eating people is when you give him chicken. Like, I shit you not, like, I've seen people, like, drive there and just drop off, like, trays of chicken. I, I know, it sounds really weird, but that's just an urban legend from where I am, so. Ah, oh, spring jump! Whee! Alright. So there's a story from me. <laughs> Since you could grab pipes above you. Yeah, I know how this works. I've played Paper Mario before, idiot. Nope, got it. <laughs> yeah, my story sucked. Boo. I, like I said, dude, I don't know that many stories. Tell you a real story that actually happened to me? I would love to hear it. I would be delighted. Wait, I think- yeah, I fucked it up. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. How do I- Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't know if I can get over there. Yeah. 
Yo, I know how to play this fucking game. Wait. Oh, I know what to do. There we go. <laughs> Alright. You got the key. I'm a smart. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> See you later. See you later, Star Lord. You little pizza shit. Wee. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> the runaway Lotta. What's going on, man? How you doing? I like his face whenever I'm riding on him, just like Gee Oh wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, is this like a thing? Is there a thing that happens? No, I guess not. Whoa, what the fuck ever, you know? Whatever. Alright, I'm gonna go heal up real quick. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait, 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 I, I know what to do, I know what to do. Oh, excuse me. Bang! Wow, I got a lot of coins now. Holy shit! All right, I'm gonna read the story that Dominator has posted. One night, I woke up to this loud song of rap, rap, rap. <laughs> Someone was rapping like boom, chicka boom, chicka boom, chicka boom. It's coming from the closet. There is a chest shaking again. Only much louder this time. Noises returned. Rap, rap, rap. I steadily approached the trunk and. D oh, and in it was. Well, don't leave me hanging, Dominator. You give me blue balls. Don't give me the blue balls. Alright, let's do the elevator key bullshit. Bang! Here we go. In it was wrapping paper. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> you mean there wasn't just like a wrapper in there? <laughs> Come on, man. Man. All right, here we go. What a squidgy fella's doing, eh? Oh, I should think they are the perpetrators behind the drawbridge debacle. Let's make haste. Find the switch and switch it back. Uh, excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Coming through. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me! God damn it! Get the fuck out of here! Wait, can I do the, the super? I came home from school one day. There's a man trying to break into my house. Oh shit, dude, what'd you do? Dude, that would be a real scary situation. Oh man, that's like the my biggest fear is like someone breaking into my house. Like goddamn dude. 
Like that that I, I'm so paranoid about that kind of shit. No idea. So yeah, so like what'd you do when you saw him trying to break in? Did you just call the cops on him? That'd be that's what I would think to do, but I don't know. Maybe you just fought him head on. It's like, what's up, bitch? Come at me. Ran away my neighbors. Called the cops. Found him in my closet, hiding with a hammer. Whoa, dude, that's like some heavy shit, bro. I'm sorry to hear that. Did he like steal anything, or was he, or did he like? I, I'm, I'm sure that like they caught him and he didn't like get away with anything. Ah, oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. God damn it. I just wasted the kerns. Thanks a lot, Mario. Now we'll get you guys rolling. Days is passing me, passing you on by. Hurry all aboard. Everybody have a good trip. Hiding with a hammer. That's interesting. King K, sup, sup, yo, G buddy! King K, you homie from the Glitz Pit. I know you remember me, dog. Uh, still living large, but in the minor league. Keep him busy. Uh, so we're having a chill again or what? Just gonna meet in the ring. Uh, keep it real. Cool, man. Oh, I had to see a therapist? Oh, dude, I totally understand. Like, I don't blame you at all. If something like that happened to me, I couldn't live alone either. God damn. Oh, he was m mentally unstable? Oh, shit, dude, that's... That's pretty bad. Uh, shit, man. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that, man. I'm sorry that happened to you. Let's go! Just because you're 18 doesn't mean you can't live alone. Shit, man, I'm 21. I don't live alone. I don't give a good doc. Goddamn. Hang on, I'm just checking on something real quick. Ah, god damn it. Never mind. Just checking on some. Alright. Attention all passengers. Thank you for riding the XS Express. Our next stop is our is our last, Poshley Heights. Alrighty. What's up, ghost man? Ghost dad, Bill Cosby. We'll be in Poshley Heights. I feel sad that I won't see you after that. Please, do come visit. I won't be going anywhere, but it's late now. Good night. Shouldn't I just, like, go to sleep? That's what I would do. Won't be able to eat to eat this amazing express. Won't be able to eat this amazing excess express chow. How depressing. Ugh. I talked to everybody the one last time. Yeah, the man is that sick to do something like that? Yeah, man. I've, uh... I've worked with mentally unstable people, and they are just... They're just a different breed, man. They are just, like... You want to talk about, like, un like unreliable and just fucking... Like, we'll do the weirdest fucking shit at any time? Like, goddamn, dude. They are scary as fuck. About time, I should say. That's from our now just beauty sleep time. Late nights cause wrinkles. That is true. Oh wait, he's not in here. Son of a bitch. Talk to this motherfucker over here. Pulling partially ice tomorrow. How's your excess ex excess express experience? I guess I don't even have to ask. You know why? 
Cause I know this shit.